What's up, you guys? What's up? Okay, so your girl's back, and I'm ready to do this bob wig. I'm trying to make it look different than straight. We're going to see what it do. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to see how I can work this out. But I've actually worked with this company prior many, many times before. You know what I'm saying? In the past. I think they got a little mad with me because um, I took too long to do one of their videos prior to this one. But listen, it's life. There's life. And that's all I'm going to leave it at. Just this life. But China Lace Wigs, okay? They've been around for quite some time, you guys. And this time I have me, I think this is a 13 by 4. Yeah, it's probably a 13 by 4 lace frontal bob. You know, summer hair. And she looks like she's a nice density. Like, she looks nice and full, you know what I'm saying? So I'm hoping that she give me life that I like. You know what I'm saying? I need to represent, especially while I'm wearing this Aretha Franklin's t-shirt right here, honey. Gotta represent. She is definitely the queen, okay? The queen of soul, of the queen, Aretha Franklin. My son got me this shirt for my birthday, so, you know, I just definitely had to wear it. I love Aretha. You know, she has some really good music. As I was saying, China Lace Wigs. And in case y'all don't know who I am, let me just reintroduce myself. My name is April. I'm a wig reviewer. Sometimes I do other things like real talk, vlog, product reviews, okay? Most of the time it is wigs, but I try to switch it up. So, you know, I'm here, been on YT for some time, you know, like they say, unproblematic, because that's what I am. However, you know, sometimes people will, you know, come at you, you gotta just like dust them off your shoulder. Hmm. I'm here to do this video. And that's what I'm going to do. I already bleached it. I don't remember if I pre-plugged it. I really don't think that I did. But if I didn't, we're going to try to do that on camera, girl. Okay? Because I really don't think I did. Let me show you how y'all wig come. And by the time y'all get back from looking at how y'all wig come, girl, I'm going to have to be on camera. Right. Fool me once, fool me twice. Shame. When you're hiding things, might as well be lies. Can you? I'm outside, waiting by the curb Too upset to drive, you get no money We gon' get lit on this ride I look too damn good to fight Don't expect me to come home tonight Don't worry about me, see you in the morning But you never thought that I could be Think I had about enough I mean, hold up, you could call me on my bluff I ain't coming to wait up Coming, don't wait up. Trying to get you to wake up. I ain't coming, don't wait up. Can't ignore my intuition, baby. I know you're typing every game you try to play. You know you could get replaced. Hey, cause I won't track a frown. No dead weight. Hit up my girls. Pull up, I'm outside. Wait about a curb. Too upset to drive, you get no money So we gon' get lit on this ride I look too damn good tonight And I just wanna have a good time Don't worry about me, see you in the morning But you never thought that I would be Think I had about enough I mean, hold up, you could call me on my bluff I ain't coming to wait up You gon' miss this body Too late, oh, I'm sorry That you never thought all right guys as you see i just jumped right into it and went ahead and flat ironed excuse me hot combed and pressed it down just to make the edges lay flush but being that i forgot to pre-plug this unit i'm just gonna go ahead and do it on camera for you guys i don't really do it that much on camera i normally do it on a canvas block mannequin head but because I forgot we're just going to do it like this normally I do put it and just keep parting it I'll part in the front a little bit thinner than this but I will part in the front and I'll just go behind it and I'll just do this a few rows up and then I'll move on 
I do think I have a video where I do show this, but you know, I'm just trying to get through this right now. But you don't want to over pluck it, so try to go in like different spots. Don't stay in the same spot for too long. And as you see, it got thinner. Now, the hairline is already thinned out for you, but because I like it a certain way, I just prefer to do a little bit more plucking. But if you don't have that experience, then the wig should just suffice you the way it is. But there are so many different tutorials. Trust me when I tell you, when I first started plucking my own wigs, girl, I had a bunch of ball patches in a couple of them. Especially the curly ones because those do take a little bit more work you know so it, it's it's trial and error and then once you get the hang of it and you have your own method it's so much easier so I just kind of like go in between I don't really stay in one section for too long at all now you see right here I'm just going to thin it out because it, a little, it, a little, it is a little bit too thick for me to tweeze you know I don't want to have too much hair in the part that I'm going to be tweezing and I just go behind and you see as I move over and now I'm gonna go ahead and press that back down the wig is really nice it is 14 inches I swear I thought it was like 16 because it's a nice length 150% density kid you not it really feels like it's like 16 inches because I've had 16 inch wigs and they were in that length as well the lace transparent really like nice and just transparent and meltable and that's what I like about China lace wigs they may come like they need to be bleached like when you get them of course you do need to bleach them but once you bleach them girl the lace is amazing it melts easily melts and because the wig is a little bit too big like goes right directly over my ear I'm just going to part it directly on top of my ear like above my ear because the lace is over flapping my ear and I'm just going to cut that lace this will help the wig fit properly it'll be able to be tucked above my ear and it'll lay flatter to my head and I'm just going to repeat that on the opposite side again now I told you guys I didn't want to you wear this wig straight because I did do a straight bob like a couple of weeks ago so exactly a couple of weeks ago maybe it was last week but I'm just trying to do something different with this you know this is a little bit more lengthier than the one I did before so I'm definitely going to put a little heat to this and style it with my curling barrel I'm not going to be um, putting too much hairspray on it because it does fit nice and snug but yes I'm going to put some heat to this and curl it you know it's great when you can do more than just wear it straight. You know, you can wear it with different type of curls, tinier curls. I really do wish that I would have used a smaller curling barrel when I did curl this wig, but this is the curler that I had on, had on hand because it was upstairs and I wasn't trying to go back down. But yeah, I've worked with China Lace wigs plenty of times, you know what I'm saying? So you can, you can check them out. They have affordable wigs. Now, you know, I like a little bit of sideburns and I always need some type of a little bit of baby hair. I don't know. You know, I use my little Dollar Tree styling moves girl dollar tree styling moves yes i said it salon selectives okay ladies best styling moves there is okay the styling moves has been around for plenty of years and i'm glad that they sell it at the dollar tree because it's worth more than a dollar now like i was saying i should have used a smaller curling barrel but i didn't want the curls too tight and let me tell you i burnt my damn fingers on this curling iron enough times while curling this hair you guys that's why i wish i would have used a smaller one but i'm gonna just speed past this and you know style may not be the style that I was going for but hey all right you guys so that's it for this wig from China Lace Wigs took me a minute to finish this because I was so busy watching live watching um my girl love lies and lace fronts live um bougie gang gang okay representing and also I was on Instagram watching live too. So it was really a spectacular showdown on Instagram live. The wig came out really nice. I do have one of these halo things, you know, like um, that you add here. You know the halos, girls, you know the halos. It's like a clip-in extension, but it's not clipped in. It's got that little wire around it and you just put it on, okay? I'm going to do, um, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna add it to this, but not in this particular video. I'm going to do it on another day because it gives it length and it's gonna also give it volume. Plus, it's definitely not going to like 
blend into my own natural hair texture that great. So my daughter's name suggestion was add it to the wig. And I was like, you know what? You are so right. Anyway, so yeah. the wig came out decent. I can't remember. I'm pretty sure I put what the lengths were, but you know me, I don't like, I like bobs and I don't like bobs and I like bobs and I don't like bobs. Like, girl, I'm so finicky and picky. And, I, you know, I just did a bob the other week, a week. So, you know, I wanted to just do something different with this one. I didn't want to wear it, you know, per se, um, the same way. So I wanted to definitely curl it a little bit different. Give it a little bit of character because that's what we do over here. We give it a little bit of character. And with this one, you can pin it up and pull it back, you know, put it up in a little bouffant, a little bouffante, whatever you want to call it. So you guys, I'm going to leave all the information down below for China Lace wigs. Girl, I burned my fingers quite enough times on this wig. I, I feel like it's time for me to go. April, you need to just go and chill now before you burn all your damn skin off. I'm just gonna go. I love you guys. I'll see you in the next one. Go, 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 go.